Ah, what a beautiful day it is. Okay, so, welcome back, people. Yesterday, we finally made it to Prim, and here we are in the beautiful and <laughs> luxurious town of Prim. Oh, great. Uh, we talked to the lieutenant in the last video, and he needs reinforcements for this place to hold it down, so I figured once we get done with this, we can head up. Um, you see those statues up there? That's an NCR outpost. We're gonna go up there next, or head in that direction. Uh, but for now, let's see what good we can do here. Uh, I'm gonna talk to this guy. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. It sure does, buddy. It's really hot here. Hello there. It's good to see a friendly face. I almost took you for a raider, I did. Name's Malcolm. Malcolm Holmes. Don't suppose you'd care to trade. I'm missing a few essentials and... Ah, oh, screw this. Lying just ain't in my nature. I'll tell it to you straight. I've been following you for a good bit now. First off, how the hell am I a raider? We're in a military... Um, like, outpost. Surrounded by good guys. And how do you mistake me for a raider? Okay. Um, uh, why are you following me? It started off innocently enough. I was traveling, as I often do, and happened to observe you picking up one of those blue star caps. You didn't show any reaction to it, so I figured you didn't know what you'd gotten your hands on. Okay, um, why didn't you... No, I'm not gonna... Yeah, why didn't you say anything before? I had to make sure of your disposition. There's a lot of jumpy folks out there that'll shoot a man as soon as talk to him. Now that we're conversing, though, I can tell you what I know about those caps. There's an old wasteland legend that says somewhere out there is a fabulous treasure from before the war. Those caps with the blue star on them, the tale goes, are the key to that treasure. They're called Sunset Sarsaparilla Stars. Okay, uh, so you collect these caps too? Nah, I gave it up years ago. Too dangerous. And even if I did still collect them, I'd tell you the same. There's people out there so mad with the idea of treasure that they'll attack strangers just on the suspicion that they have some of those caps. Nah, man, you know you're carrying like seven of them. But whatever, thanks for the info. I'll be going now. No problem. If you do end up trying to collect more stars, watch out for a man named Alan Marks. He's killed several people for their stars already. Alan Marks, okay. I'll, uh, you know, I'll keep an eye out for the name or whatever, I don't know. Okay, there are landmines all up on this bridge. <laughs> man, I... <laughs> oh man, okay, whatever, I mean, we still got past nonetheless. Okay. Is there any... I mean, we heard from the lieutenant that the uh, powder gangers have split off and some are here. So we're gonna go see what we can do. Oh yeah, there's a baddie right there. On the other side of this building, of course. Uh, seems like there's a couple. Oh yeah, look. One's just chilling right there. Oh. He's on the move. What's he doing? Dude, I'm gonna pop this guy. I pressed the wrong button. Great. What? Oh no. Stop. Stop it. Oh no. My pride and joy. <laughs> oh man, dude, you got dumpster, dude. Don't walk up on me. Oh man. Take everything you got. Thank you. And I'm overweight now. 
Okay, I'm gonna pick up your stuff. Uh, let's see what we can combine. Come on, so close. I'm gonna have to drop something. Okay, here we go. Okay. Oh my god, that was loud. It hits it hit concrete. That's so stupid. We're gonna go in here. The Vicky and Vance Casino. Whoa. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. Who are you? Johnson Nash is my name. Husband to Ruby Nash. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. I'm a courier of the Mojave. Express. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I lost a package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order you can show me? Yeah, sure, right here. Oh, so you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over it, but we couldn't turn down the caps. Some men stole my package. <laughs> uh, a man in a checkered suit with some thugs. Did they pass this way? Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. Yeah, one of them shot me. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. Okay, I'd like to ask you something else, though. I guess I don't have anywhere better to be. Uh, yeah, what you got for sale? Sure, have a look. Let's see what I can sell to you, good sir. You can take that. Take that. Uh... Have that. Okay. What you got? How are my weapons doing? Oh yeah, they're doing okay. I'll take that. Uh, take that duct tape though. Ooh, chainsaw alloy frame. Oh, dude, once I get that chainsaw, we are in business. That is my go-to melee weapon. I enjoy using it. Uh, I'll buy some of these. Um, what else you got? Okay, yeah, there you go. Another satisfied customer. See ya. Bye. Okay, well, let's go save the deputy, shall we? I think it's actually already marked. No, it's not. Well, it technically is actually. Um, put those down there. It sucks how I can't do it opposite. Like, I can combine the leather to the light. But I can't do the leather, or the light leather to the leather. <laughs> um, I guess I'll wear that for extra perception. 
Yeah, okay. Okay, deputy. Let's go see if I can save you, shall we? There's a guy up there. Where is he? Oh, yeah, see, look, there he is right there. Okay, let's kill him real quick, actually. Dude. He's coming down here. He is dead. Okay. Oh boy. Definitely bumped that up to 50. Bumped that up. Okay. Deputy Beagle, I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. I'm going to save you. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. And they already saw me. That did nothing. Stop it. My aim, though. Okay, so no one else knows we're here. Oh, wait, hang on. Let me reload. Okay. Uh, take that whiskey, though. Yeah, come and uh, come and check out that strange light. Yeah, there you go, buddy. <laughs> you are dead now. Sheriff, are you in here? Hey, where's that guy's body? Is this it? Yeah, there we go. Okay, I'm over the way. Dude, he just killed some- oh god. Stop throwing grenades! Dude. You never rush someone with a gun. <laughs> what a- oh, oh, look at this guy. Hey, hey, you get out of here. Dude, how do you survive something like that? That's so stupid. Oh, now he's dead, okay. This guy right here was, I don't even know what he was thinking, dude. I mean, he had a death wish, and he got it. 
Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Yeah. There we go. There might be one more dude in here. Hello? Yeah, there's one more guy in here. He's just sitting down! Oh god. It's the leader! Hey, stop! Dude, I can't see! Ow. Dude, you are a. You are just a pure douchebag right now. Stop. You like that? Do I like what? Do you like that? Okay, hey, I need to switch in. Oh my god, what are you made out of? There you go. Hit the dirt. Oh my god. Dude, I'm gonna be so pissed if this video's audio is crap. I'm going to be so upset. Okay. Oh, I still can't walk. Sheriff, come save me! Beagle? I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. I hear you may have information on some cons that came through here with a guy in a checkered suit. Indeed I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. How about you tell me right now, or I'm gonna leave you here. Well, you look to be a trustworthy sort. Okay, I'll tell you what I know. Thank you. I overheard them saying that they're on their way to Novak. If you want to follow them, I strongly suggest that you follow the road through Nipton. There are a lot of dangerous things out in the desert. And you won't have me with you to protect you, as I oh, need okay. to stay here and keep Prim safe. It would be so very delightful if you set me free. Yeah, here you go. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way outside. Yeah, run, you coward. Then I'll defer to your superior appraisal of character and prowess in contests of arms and see you outside. Yeah, yeah, get out of here. Is this purified water? Ooh, I'll take that. I would take that stuff, but I... I'm very short on, uh inventory space at the moment. Okay. I need to find a workbench. <laughs> Dude, no one's alive. There's no need. <laughs> See ya. Wow. Hey there. Why'd your voice change? Well, that was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Yeah, buddy. Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course, but it was quite thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in Prim. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Um... What are you talking about? You're the sheriff now. Oh, no. I'm just a deputy, and I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's called chain of command. Okay, uh, what are the qualifications for a sheriff? It should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. Someone who'll settle down and watch over us. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Myers who has some experience as a sheriff. He may be a good choice. Also, with the NCR so close by, you may be able to get them to take over the town. Not sure why they haven't helped out already. 
Yeah, sure. I'll bring Raw. Uh, yeah, I'll bring Law and Order back to Prim. You will. That's just marvelous. I'll start thinking up questions for the okay, yeah. the sheriff that was incarcerated. Okay, just just shut up, please. You're you're so annoying, dude. Okay. Before we do anything else, let us tell these people the town is safe. Where's that old dude? I hear you're going to help find Prim a new sheriff. Mighty kind of you to take an interest. Yeah, sure thing, lady. Where'd that old dude go? I don't see him anywhere. Man, everyone's got a gun. Okay, I don't know where this old dude is. I... Howdy. Why is your voice change? What, what in the world are you? Okay, well. Onward.